How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be comparing the Mythical Rod versus the Destiny Rod versus the King's Rod. So let's go ahead and get straight into this video. Remember to leave a like, subscribe and comment your username down below because I am giving away all of the game passes in Roblox Fish. So if you guys do want a chance to win any of them, leave a like, subscribe and comment your username down below along with whatever game pass you guys want. Anyways, let's go ahead and start with this video. So first things first guys, we have the Mythical Rod which costs 110,000 credits and this is the best money maker in the game rainbow fishes sell for a lot which is what you get used to catch it catch this also the rod itself is rainbow too no cyan so that's a plus it just looks really nice and you can buy this before king's rod or after very cool rod in general and should be your first end game rod that's right if you are just just got to the end game i recommend going for the mythical rod because this thing can help you guys make so much money and you guys can buy from the wandering merchant by the way the wandering merchant spawns anywhere on the map and you'll get a little alert at the top of your screen i think it's a really cool rod and it is one of the cheapest rods out of the three so i definitely recommend going for this rod if you just got to end game guys because it will help you guys make a lot of money besides that here are all of the stats it has a lot of speed of zero percent a luck of 45 percent a control of 0.05 percent a resilience of zero percent and a max kg of 2000 now i recommend getting the resilient re resilience enchant on this thing because it will help you guys out a lot next up guys we have the king's rod right here which costs just over 120,000. So this one is... So guys, this rod makes it really, really easy to fish because its control is 0.5 and a 35% resilience with no KG limit. The only downside to this uh, to this rod is that it has a negative 45% lower speed, which does bring it down a lot. So you guys can go ahead and use the swift enchant if you do wish to. If not, you can, well, suffer with the negative 45% lure. So again, I would not recommend this if you guys want to make money, but if you guys are trying to catch a lot of fish, and just trying to finish your best tree, then I recommend going for the King's Rod because it's only 120,000 and endgame. After you guys get the uh, Mythical Rod, I recommend going for this because it'll be a lot easier to get after the Mythical Rod. Anyways, guys, next up, we have the Destiny Rod, the most expensive rod in the game at 190,000. So this one, had you need a 70% best tree even to be able to buy this thing before. And yeah... So the only advantage to this rod I can think of is the fact that it has a 180% luck boost, guys. That's absolutely crazy. Once again, just like the Mythical Rod, it has a 0% resilience, and it also has a 0% control. So it's going to be really, really hard to fish. So again, I recommend getting the resilience enchant on this. And once again, it has a negative 45% lure speed. Hope that helped you guys. I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.